Hi, everyone. Welcome to Saturday right here on Let's Talk in English on PTS and the radio. I'm Andrea. And I'm Gabe. Are you ready to review this week's lesson in Hualien? We hope you are. Yes, we were in Hualien this week and we'll be going there for one week every month. But this week, our story began. We met Patty. And Patty is visiting Taiwan. That's right. She's visiting her grandma. And we met her cousin Roger this week as well. And where did they go, friends? Do you remember? Gabe, do you remember where they went? Oh, right. Hmm. This time they went to a tea house. That's right. And we learned how to talk about dining out, going to a restaurant. And also about drinking tea. So, friends, a good idea is for you to sit down, enjoy a nice cup of tea while you watch our Saturday review. Now, Gabe, what kind of tea are you drinking today? Well, today I'm drinking green tea. It's not black tea. It's not chrysanthemum tea. It's just plain green tea. And green tea, of course, is very healthy. And we hope that you enjoy it. Gabe, is it good?、Mm. It's amazing. Thank you. Good, good. All right, friends. We hope you enjoy our Saturday review. We'll go back to Hualien. Then we'll also see Thomas as he helps us beat the G E P T. The G E P T. All right. Well, I am excited. Are you excited, Andrea? I am excited. I love Saturdays. All right. Well, let's go and review and take a look at this week's lesson right now. Conversation replay. Three people are in a car in Hualien. Grandma Jones is driving. Two of her grandchildren, Roger and Patty, are with her. They are going to a tea house. Grandma and Roger are telling Patty about Taiwan. Patty is excited. This is her second day in Taiwan. She is having a lot of fun already. Grandma, Roger, and Patty get to the tea house. It is beautiful. Patty thinks about tea. She remembers her last day with her mom. Patty, come and drink some tea with me. I can't, Mom. I'm too excited. I'm leaving for Taiwan today. <laughs> I know, but have some tea. Sit down and relax. Okay, okay. Let me pour the tea for you. I can't do this again for three months. Are you sad, Mom? Yes, my little girl is leaving. Mom, I'm not little. I'm seventeen years old. Patty, I have something for you. A journal. <laughs> Thanks. Write about all your Taiwan adventures. Okay. Thanks, Mom. You are staying with your dad's brother and his family, but please go see my sister and her family too. <laughs> okay. Explore Hualien. Take a lot of pictures. But be careful. I know. Don't worry, Mom. Okay, honey. I love you. Patty, are you listening to us? What? Oh, Grandma. I'm sorry. I'm thinking about Mom. I understand. Your mom is wonderful. My son married the right girl. <laughs> so, Patty, what is your favorite tea? I like all kinds of tea. Well, which kind do you like best? Green, red, or oolong tea? Red tea? What's that? It's black tea. People call it red tea here. Interesting. 
Here is a menu, Patty. Sorry, Grandma. <laughs> I can't read Chinese. You can't? Well, you're going to learn to read some Chinese this summer. <laughs> okay. Do you like fruit tea, or how about flower tea? Flowers in tea. Yeah, like chamomile or jasmine. Oh, those are flowers. I didn't know. Can you just choose something for me? Good idea. Roger, you come here often. Choose something wonderful for Patty. There are so many teas on the menu. How can you choose just one? You keep coming back until you try them all. And there are other things on the menu besides tea. Really? Do they have coffee? No, not at this tea house. But they do have some food. Food at a tea house? Cool. Let's order some food. Hi, Roger. Who is this? Do you have a new girlfriend? She's pretty. Thank you, but I'm not Roger's girlfriend. I'm his grandmother. <laughs> I know, Mrs. Jones. Hi, Derek. This is my cousin, Patty. She's staying with us this summer. Hello, Patty. It's nice to meet you. It's nice to meet you too. You don't look like Roger. <laughs> well, our dads are brothers, but my mom is Chinese. She's from Hualien. Derek, we're ready to order. Oh. Okay. Hi, I'm Derek. I am your waiter today. What can I get for you? I would like some oolong tea. I would like some green tea, and Patty will have fruit tea. We'd also like some chicken feet and blood rice cake. Okay. I'll be right back. Chicken feet? Yes, you'll love them. <laughs> wow. Taiwan really is different from America. Here is your tea and food. Oh, this looks so pretty. The teapots and the little teacups. I have to take a picture. I can take the picture, Patty. You can be in it. That will be more beautiful. Oh, okay. Wait, let's pour some tea into the cups. Then, let's hold our cups. And... Ouch! Are you okay? I think so. Wow, that's a hot. had traditional tea like this for years. We usually use tea bags in America. Are you sure you didn't burn your fingers, Patty? Yeah, I'm okay. Look, my fingers aren't even red. These little teacups get really hot really fast. I remember now. How's your tea, Patty? It's wonderful. You should try some of mine too. Okay. Ouch! Derek, you burned me. What? No, I didn't, Jim. Yes, you did. You spilled a pot of tea on me. Look at my clothes. They're all wet. And so is my arm. Uh, I'm really sorry. How did that happen? I didn't touch your teapot. Yes, you did. You are a terrible server. You should be fired. Fired? No, I really need this job. Excuse me, I'm sure it was just an accident. How do you know? Did you see it happen? Well, no. 
Did anyone here see what happened? That's what I thought. Derek wouldn't spill hot tea on you on purpose. Well, he did. I am going to talk to your boss. Lao Ban, Lao Ban. Excuse me, but Jim is lying. Dear Journal, I'm having Taiwan adventures already. Grandma and Roger took me to a traditional tea house yesterday. The building was beautiful, and the tea was delicious. I liked drinking tea made from tea leaves instead of tea bags. <laughs> I also liked the blood rice cake. It was yummy. Grandma told me about other tea houses she has been to. She has lived in Taiwan for 50 years, so she's been to a lot of tea houses. A really exciting thing happened at the tea house. A customer, Jim, said that Derek, our server, spilled hot tea on him and burned him. But Jim didn't act like he was in pain. Also, if Jim's skin were burned, it should be red and hot. His arm was wet, but not red, so I knew he lied. Then we checked Jim's table. His pot of tea was almost full, and we found a half-empty water bottle. Jim must have poured the water on himself. We found out that Jim is jealous of Derek. Jim wanted Derek's job, but the boss hired Derek instead of Jim. Well, I'm going to bed. It's only 8 o'clock, but jet lag is making me so tired. The Taiwan Traveler, Patty. Word Power! It's time for Word Power! This week we're talking about tea. Let's drink some. Black tea is one of the most popular kinds of tea. In some countries, black tea is called red tea. Black tea has a strong flavor. Black tea. Black tea. Green tea is another popular tea. Green tea is a light green color, and its flavor is not as strong as black tea. Drinking green tea is good for your health. Green tea. Green tea. Oolong tea is popular in China and other Asian countries. Oolong tea is made differently from green or black tea, so its flavor is a little different. Oolong tea. Oolong tea. If you like sweet teas, you can try fruit tea. Fruit tea is made by adding fruit to regular black tea. The fruit makes the tea sweet. Fruit tea. Fruit tea. If you like tea, but you don't want caffeine, you can drink herbal teas. Herbal teas are made with dried flowers, leaves, and other kinds of plants. Herbal tea. Herbal tea. I'm thirsty. I think I'll get some tea. Remember all these words when you talk about tea, and you'll have word power! Gabe, I think I need some more tea. You need more tea? That's right! Well, let's call our waitress in and see if she can get you some more tea. Okay, but before we do that, we should say thank you to everyone for joining us today. We'll see you next week on Let's Talk in English. On PTS and on the radio. Have a great weekend, everyone. <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye.